cute, cool camera action. Uh, welcome back to the Wheel and Racing channel. Uh, this is gonna be episode number 19. Uh, today is Saturday. Uh, we are two days away from the Quad Cities Running Festival, and now we are 15 days away from the Des Moines Ironman. Um, so, gonna do something a little bit differently with this video. We're just gonna kind of give you a, we'll call it a day in the life kind of thing, or a vlog, or whatever you wanna call it, categorize it as. But we're essentially gonna, I'm gonna walk you through what I got today, tomorrow, and then race day for Quad Cities. Um, as well as kind of recapping this past week's training. So um, today, pretty simple day. Um, I slept in, played Civilization on the PS4. Uh, that took until about one o'clock. Um, had some pancakes and eggs in the morning and then my, my sourdough bread, I'm a big sourdough fan. Um, but yeah, and then I did a hour and 15 endurance ride on Trainer Road. So I like bought something or another, I'll post it up on the screen. Um, and then once Elise gets back, we're gonna do probably like 45 to an hour uh, run. I'm not too picky. Um, we'll just kind of see what feels good. So uh, right now, um, I had to go out and grab some burritos my coworker gifted me uh, from the, from work. I didn't want them to go bad, so I got those. While I was out, got myself a little uh, chocolate cream cold brew. Um, it feels like summer, so this is an appropriate drink for summer. Um, and then I'm also gonna have some more sourdough bread. So, pretty exciting stuff. I'm gonna just look at that. I actually started doing sourdough probably, God, it's probably been almost half a year away. Oh, Milo attempted to jump, failed. Can't do it the second time. He does it and knocks into our stuff. Great job, Al. Anyway, um, I watched a video. Ryan Hall talked about what he eats. He mentioned how he really enjoys sourdough and then listed off a few probably not true um, details about what it could do for you. But you know what? This sits really well in my stomach. It always tastes good. And it's arguably my favorite kind of bread. So. Sourdough for the win. Made it to the run. There's Elise, she's ecstatic. We've delayed this run by probably a few hours. We're getting it done though. Alright, we are here. If we go this way, the way you want to go by Walmart. It would go to Waterworks Park. So if we go this way, we go to West Walmart. I'm gonna go to Walmart. Walmart it is. pre-race run done. Uh, we left this morning probably close to 10-ish or so um, in Iowa City right now. Gotta grab some shirts for Run Ablaze, get some good burritos from a place called Estella, um, and then we'll head over to Davenport, pack a pickup, and then Chili's of course, and that'll be it. So pretty exciting stuff. Uh, run was like just over five. At, 734 pace, nothing crazy. I did a two minute tempo uh, and then three by 20 60s. So, yeah. All right, well, it is race morning. We've got a 
pretty decent temperature. A little breezy out here today. You can kind of see some of the flags whipping around. It's not a lot of flags up here. Anyway, waiting for Austin to uh, come find me so we can start a warm up. So on to the weekly training update quickly before we close out this video. So this is going to be the, the week after Chattanooga 70.3. Uh, so it's kind of feeling a little bit sore, but honestly not too bad going into Monday. Um, I had a fairly early flight for myself, didn't get in at midnight, got in closer to that 8 o'clock range, so much better. Um, so I did a recovery swim uh, kind of due to the fact that the main pool was closed, so I sent over to the program pool. I uh, was kind of swimming myself 45 minutes, hit up the massage, and then we were on to Tuesday. Uh, Tuesday we started off with some thresholds, and actually I was able to hold around that 110 range uh, for some threes and twos with uh, TJ, so that was good. On to the evening, we had a 4x4 on the schedule uh, for the bike. I was holding about 369 watts for those. And then come Wednesday, uh, I had pushed Tuesday due to weather, so Wednesday morning got a workout with Cody and Blake. We had six by three minute CV. Uh, I was kind of floating between that. Uh, I think it was 4:45 to about 5:05 range, and then um, had six by 20 seconds, uh, just kind of up tempo, and then six by 30 second hill. So that was a really good workout. I was really surprised how well my legs uh, worked that day. Uh, came back that evening. Had a kind of distance day session to kind of replace Monday. So uh, this is the one you've seen probably before. So this is going to be 800, 200 by 4, 600, 2 by 300. This is all on the 120 base. So pretty standard. Uh, coming to Thursday, we had speed day. Uh, it's lots of 25s and 50s. It's pretty, pretty standard. Uh, and then that evening came back with 4 by progressive. 10 minutes. Um, it was probably closer to, it was started out with 11, 10 and a half, 10 and 10. So I guess it's a little more than 10 minutes, but uh, 250 watts first round, 293, 321, 357. Um, last round was tough, but got it done. Uh, jogged for 22 minutes, still about 5K off the bike before trivia night. Uh, and then that came back that Friday. I actually had taken off work. Um, and so got one of my last big rides in before uh, Des Moines. I did 100 miles uh, with a uh, 1 by 80, 180 minute tempo. So just, you know, three hours there um, in a good rhythm. And then got off the bike, went over to Austin's house, which is pretty close to where I started. I got a four minute jog. Came back that evening. Um, not too, actually, you know, I, it, was, it was more of an afternoon, honestly. Um, ate some parking lot sushi and got in the water right after that just to make sure I didn't miss pool time. So 
um, but we had kind of a pull focus. Uh, legs are pretty trash from the morning, so it makes sense. Uh, and then we started to kind of get ready for a Monday race, uh, even though it is a C race. I still want to make sure I can race well, so um, only had a bike and a run on Saturday. Just endurance pace for the bike, and then did some easy miles with Elise down at the Great Belt Trail. Then came back that Sunday. Um, we drove a bit and then stopped in Iowa City for a 40 minute jog. So that was going to be the full week. We had 17 hours, 4 minutes, you know, and we'll uh, probably be somewhat similar this week, but a little more spread. You know, we had that about 6 hour day on Friday. Um, that's not going to be happening this week. So, um, yeah. Pretty exciting. We're getting really close to Des Moines. Iron Man. Thanks again for watching and, uh, Hope you guys enjoy the video.